what do we have in the mail today? We have a magazine and a heavy package. And the package is from Swiss Micros. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And today we have a present from Swiss Micros, a Switzerland based company who have been producing awesome RPN calculator since 2011. Let's open the package without any further delay. Nice, it even comes with a pouch. Pouches and covers for a calculator was a thing back then. Sadly, the trend is changing. And here we have the Swiss Micros DM15L. The calculator is small enough to fit in my palm and big enough so that it feels comfortable when I operate it. It has a weight to it so that it feels like you are holding it when you are holding it. The case is made up of titanium and it is sandblasted and anodized in this nice brown color. As it is sandblasted, your palm has a nice grip to it. We have the model number, error chart, conversion table and many other details on the back etched by laser. The importance of keys in a calculator is first. Without proper keys, you will miss the keystrokes. The DM15L uses dome switches which give you a feedback force when you press it. So you will know whether your stroke registered on the calculator. The on button is little lower than the other buttons to differentiate it from the other buttons. The keys are spaced well and you don't feel like you are using a pocket calculator. I can clearly read what's on the display from majority of the angles. The software has a variety of fonts. All Swiss Micros calculators use a specific notation called reverse polish notation. Let's see what it means briefly. You do calculations like this in your normal calculator. In your junior grade in school you would have added 25 and 9 as like this.
and multiply it as like this and subtracted them as like this and that's what called a reverse Polish notation. So in RPN calculators you will need to type 25 and hit enter and type 9 and press addition symbol to add both 25 and 9. The order is same for multiplication and subtraction and division. I have a problem for you. The question is, the solution is, it is known that 1 mole of aluminium 3 plus requires 3 mole of electrons to give 1 mole of aluminium metal. The atomic mass of aluminium is 26.98 gram mole inverse. 1 gram of aluminium 3 plus requires 0 0.1112 farads of electricity by the formula number of electron times Faraday constant divided by atomic mass equals amount of electricity to displace the metal from the solution. So 40 grams of aluminium 3 plus requires 4.447 farads of electricity. The key strokes for this calculation is 3 enter 96500 multiply 26 0.98 divide 40 multiply This calculator can even do programming. That means if you have the formula for a specific problem and if you want to know the output, you can just enter the given values and get the output. Here I have programmed a program to calculate the time taken by an object that is free falling from a height h towards the earth with acceleration to, due to gravity as 9.8 meters per second square. So when I input any height, I can get the time taken by the object to reach the ground. In conclusion, the DM15L is a flagship calculator from Swiss Micros. It uses reverse Polish notations and it's well built, feels premium and you should definitely try it out. It's expensive as like any other craft from Switzerland and it's worth each and every penny. Stay calculating and I will catch you next time.